Hello everyone, welcome back to another AI video. On this one, we're in chat GPT-4 and I'm going to show you how to turn on and use memories. That's right, memory has come to chat GPT so it can remember what you said in one conversation in the next. Get, let me give you an example here. I have nothing open here except chat GPT, no conversations, everything's been deleted. What is the name of my bulldog? I'm going to hit that, watch this. Your bulldog's name is Kingston. It has remembered that. Let me go through this with you step by step. All right, so the first step here is this should be on by default, but this could change in the future. So I'm going to click on my name down here at the bottom left, and then I'm going to go ahead and click on settings. When you do that, under personalization, so it's general, then it's personalization, you'll see memory, and you'll see there's a little toggle switch. So you can go ahead and turn that on and off. So let's just go ahead and turn that back on. Come on, Curtis. And while you're here, you can also manage. So watch this. When I click on manage, it's going to go ahead and give us all of the memories that we've committed so far. So here's one. I have a bulldog named Kingston who is nine years old. And then I like to be called by my first name. And my name is Curtis Bike. These, first, these bottom two here are in by default. So that just comes with uh, automatically. And then there you go. And if you want to turn it off, like I said, you can either clear chat GPT's memory or you can just turn this toggle off. All right, and if you want to give it a memory, it's automatically on, but I'm just going to type something in like, I live in Canada. And then I'm basically just saying, hey, remember this. So let's see what happens here. What is it going to say to me now? Curtis lives in Canada. Manage memories, click on that, and then I can go ahead and add that in as a memory. So got it, you're in Canada. How's the weather up there today? It's not very good, actually memory updated. Do you see that right there? So that is the entire process in a nutshell, guys. Thanks for watching.